Yo guys, welcome back to another video here on my channel and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys the top 5 working GTA 5 online glitches after patch 1.50 so I hope you guys do go on to enjoy this video and if you do, please make sure to leave a like down below and also subscribe to my channel because it does help out a lot and also comment down below if any of these glitches do help you or if they don't then I'll try and help you guys out just in case you do some steps wrong so I hope you guys go on to enjoy this video and let's get straight into the first glitch so for the first glitch in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get the black duffel bag using the husky jobs and unfortunately this glitch only PS4 only but if you have PS4 the link will be in the description of how to get the black duffel bag but um, let me guys know if you want to get any other colours because I do have a lot bookmarked of different colours so just let me guys know in the comments down below so all you guys want to do is just simply start up the mission by going to your bookmark and then going to last team standing now you guys just need to wait until someone joins and then you can just simply start up the mission. So now once you guys have launched into the mission just like I have here, you will see that you will spawn with a dark black duffel bag. It's, I, I think it's a bit darker than the usual black duffel bag that you can get with other glitches. But anyway, as you guys, once you guys have loaded into the mission, what you guys will do is bring up the interaction menu and go to style, accessories and go once left on the d-pad to equip the LCD earpiece. And once you guys have done that, you just want to simply quit the job using your phone. So now once you guys have loaded back into GTA 5 Online, you will see that you have the duffel bag. And now I'm going to be showing you guys how to save it. So all you guys want to do is either call a buzzard from the CEO or get one of your oppressors. And then just fly to the starting bit of the sea at the beach over here. And you guys want to go quite up high just like I do in the video. And then all you guys simply want to do is just jump out of your buzzard or jump off your oppressor depending on which vehicle you are in and then you guys just want to jump out and then aim for the Vespucci beach mask store and you guys want to make sure you aim right for the very front of the store otherwise you won't be able to save it in time so as you guys can see here I just you just need to aim right for the front and make sure you don't hit any trees or any any objects in the way otherwise it will cut you off and you won't be able to save it so as you guys can see I have landed right in front of the store just like that and then you guys want to spam right on the d-pad until you go into the hat section so now you guys just want to save the outfit and I recommend double saving just to make sure and then once you guys have done that when you back out if you see two parachutes on the floor that means it has successfully worked so now if you go ahead and just equip the outfit you'll see that you have the black duffel bag now in my opinion this is the best duffel bag glitch because you do get the black duffel bag from this and you still can change outfits which I think in my opinion is pretty cool so that was the first glitch I hope you guys enjoyed that now let's get into the second glitch so with this next glitch in this video I'm going to be showing you guys this brand new wall breach at the Los Santos customs in the upper area in the higher area of Los Santos so all you guys want to do is just make your way to the Los Santos customs then just shoot the guy inside so then it will let you in and say that Los Santos is closed then you'll be able to get outside of your car when you're inside of the customs so now you guys just want to come to this corner that I am in now and you guys want to try and launch yourself up onto the stack of tires just like I do here so I do actually miss aim it twice so on the third go you will see that I actually get it so that was the second go and I did miss again because you guys want to make sure you aim in the right area so I aim just here as you'll see and I did land on top and now as you see when your character will stand up he will go into the roof so now you are above the Los Angeles customs and no one can kill you here but you guys need to watch out for the barrier just out just along the edge of the Los Angeles customs because if you do go down there it will just make you fall and then just land on the road but there is in fact a corner over here where I go just like that which you will be able to land just down there but I do actually mess it up and I just end up falling but if you do land there you can just kill everyone that goes into the science customs just to troll people so that's the second glitch now let's get straight into the third glitch so with this next glitch I'm going to be showing you guys the rapid fire revolver glitch so some of you guys probably do know this but what you will need for this glitch is a double action revolver just like I have here so now for the first part you want to press L1 and R2 at the same time and then once you guys do that it should shoot a bullet a bullet and then all you guys want to do is just shoot the rest of the bullets and you will see that the last bullet is a rapid fire of all the bullets in the clip so as you guys see I've just done it a few times here so this is a really cool glitch if you want to just kill the police easily or just test it on your friends let's say you're in a revolver fight 
and you just do this glitch to kill them easier. So that was the third glitch and I hope you guys enjoyed this glitch and now let's get into the fourth glitch. So with this next glitch I'm going to be showing you guys this cool new loungewear glitch where it merges the bottom part of the loungewear with any other top. So the first thing you can do is make sure make your way over to the loungewear and just equip any robe just like I have here and as you guys did see I have a parachute on so I just had to back out and take that off. So now once you guys have equipped this loungewear what you guys want to do is make your way over to the mask and make sure you have this long green scarf here just like I do because you will need that. So now you guys just want to equip that and you will see that it will take the top half of the robe off but you will leave the second half on so now what you guys can do with this is just make a cool different like clothing outfit so as you guys see i have made a cool outfit over here so if you want you guys can also make this outfit as well but, or you can just add some different things to your outfit but if you want you can copy this outfit just like i have here So now once you guys have made your outfit you can just go ahead and simply save it. So now once so that was the that was the fourth glitch, so let's get straight into the next glitch. So with the next glitch I'm gonna be showing you guys the invisible arms glitch and this does actually stick so then they will not disappear just like other glitches where that show you how to get the invisible arms. So this glitch does stick. So the first thing you want to do is make your way over to any ammunition store because I find that that is easier. Now you guys want to equip any scuba outfit, but I decided to equip the black scuba outfit. And once you guys have equipped that, you just want to go ahead and simply save it to any outfit slot. Now once you guys have done that, you want to make your way over to bodysuits and just equip any bodysuits outfit just like I do here. So now once you guys have equipped the bodysuit, what you want to simply do is just make your way over to the very edge of the pier where the telescope is. And then you guys will be doing the telescope glitch. As you guys can see I've made my way over to the edge where the telescope is. So now you guys want to simply go ahead and do the telescope glitch. Now once you've done that you want to bring up the interaction menu, go to style and equip the outfit with the black scuba um, outfit. So now once you guys have done that you will see that the bodysuit head will appear on the black scuba outfit. So now once you guys have done this, all you want to do is just make your way over to the suburban near the burger shop and the convenience store. Just, just past the pier over here. So as you can see it's not that long to get there. Now once you guys are at the Suburban, when well, you can go to any closed store, it's up to you, but I decided decide to go to the Suburban because it's closest. So now you guys just want to go over to any top section, and you guys want to make your way down to Vest. So now once you guys have made your way down to Vest, you just want to simply equip the first Vest, which is this blue sweater Vest here. So now once you guys have equipped that Vest, all you want to do is make your way over to the beach, once again and make your way over to this part here just at the edge of the water so i want you guys to make your way over to this part of the water or it could just be any part of the water i just decided to go to this part you guys just want to simply go in the water and wait till your character starts swimming now once he starts swimming you will see he will equip this scuba gear now once your character has done that you guys want to simply take the easy way out now once you guys have done that you will see your character spawn and will take off the scuba um, scuba gear and you will see that he now has invisible arms or she has invisible arms so now all you guys want to do is make your way over to the mask store or you can make your way over to any clothing store i decided to make my way over to bingo clothing As you guys can see, I've just made my way over to Binko Clothing. So now what you guys can do is just go ahead and save the outfit. So once you guys have saved the outfit, you can go ahead and just change things on the outfit. So I will show you guys here that I just put some 
put some utility pants on. And see, so just put on the black highs pants. And I did also decide to customize the outfit a little bit, but I just sped it up. So that was the fifth glitch in this video, and I hope you guys did enjoy this video. And if you did, please make sure to leave a like down below and also subscribe because it does help out my channel a lot. And if this did also help, comment down below if, if one of the glitches didn't work and I'll try to help you guys out because you might have missed a step out. So thank you guys for watching this video and if you guys want some more top 5 glitches, please make sure to let me know in the comments down below. So thank you guys for watching, I'll see you in my next video and peace.